Hey everyone, welcome back to the Aerial Media Pros channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at the custom Pelican case for the Matrice 100. So I'm really excited about this case because it's been a couple months in the making. We've been working on it and making revisions to it, making sure it is the best bang for your buck and makes the most sense for the Matrice because it is such a complicated machine. Um, we're going to be walking you through in this video just what the features of the case itself are and then we'll walk through the inside and uh, you should have a pretty good idea by the end of this video um, what this entails and why it's such a value add for the Matrice 100 series from DJI. So first I'll start off with the case. The case itself again is made by Pelican, is what's one of the top distributors and suppliers of protective cases and this is what they're really known for is these protector cases which have, you could see here, this locking system, really secure, so it almost has a dual lock on there. Made of really hard plastic, which is weatherproof, dustproof, and the whole thing is sealed and watertight. So it's a great case made from the Pelican 1640. So that's what we use for this because it's deep enough and able to carry all the accessories that you would on the Matrice. So we really had to go with the biggest case possible. As you can see, here we have roller wheel design on the back. So these are two, four roller wheels here. There's carrying handles made of the same plastic. So those are really secure. And this is really built to be able to throw into the back of a truck or any, any sort of vehicle and travel really well with it. Um, you could definitely check this into the airport and it's gonna protect all your equipment from the inside and out. So I'll actually just lift it up so you can see the last feature here. With the roller wheel design, we also have this handle. So this just comes up here and locks in place so you can roll it around on the ground. And when it's on the ground, it'll have these legs here just to keep everything nice and flat. So it's designed really well. Um, the last thing here is this breathing valve. So if you're going to go uh, send it on the airline or anything like that, you're going to make sure that the air is not being compressed while it's in the cabin and it needs to actually release the air that's wanting to escape as you gain an altitude. And so the reason for this valve here is for it to do that, to be able to breathe. And so it has that technology and won't let air in so you're not going to see any water or anything coming through this valve in case you do end up um, in more of wet conditions or anything like that. It's still gonna stay, stay protected, but this is really important so you can keep your stuff from actually imploding um, if you were to check it on an airline. So really great feature there. Let's go ahead and open it up and I'll show you the inside. All right, so we'll just easily pull up on these locks here to unlock the case. And if uh, you do wanna lock the case, you, do have, you most likely have expensive equipment in here. Um, they do have these stainless steel holes um, where you can apply any sort of lock and keep everything safe from anybody else opening up your case. So here's the interior. Um, this is made of a military grade foam so it's not going to degrade over time and it's stiff and sturdy enough to last. So you can see the layout that we've built here. Um, again we've done a bunch of revisions to make sure you get the most in this space while keeping enough space here to protect everything. So we'll just start from the top to the bottom. So we have your propeller compartment here. So you put those in there, and this will be a charging compartment. You could put chargers or any sort of accessories, and that applies to these holes as well. Um, these are just accessory compartments, so you can put anything in there um, according to what equipment that you do have, but usually we'll just put the charger in here. Um, it's pretty obvious these are battery compartments, so there's up to six here. However, these accessory compartments can also hold batteries, so we'll just grab one here real quick. So the battery will slide in like this and everything closes just right on top of it. Same thing with these, if you wanted to fit it sideways, those go in just like that. So, take that out. On the left hand side here we have your radio control compartments. Um, one of them we left the foam still in so I could just show you you can take any level of foam and that applies to most of these compartments. So if you don't want it to be as deep, just like these accessory compartments here, you can uh, just leave the foam there or you can go ahead and pull it out. For the radio controller, you'll see that we do need it to go all the way down to be able to fit. But if you're only using a single controller, you can leave it up 
at this level and just use this as an accessory compartment or put your camera box will fit in here as well for the X3. That'll fit right in that compartment. Great, but if you're gonna put the radio control, you do need it to go all the way down so you can put that securely in there. The last thing before we cover the Matrice layout here, you have these tablet compartments over on this side and that'll either fit a iPad mini, two of them, or you can actually pull out this center piece here and you could fit full size iPads in there as well. So depending on what you're using, most of the time we're using uh, iPad minis or iPad airs and that'll fit those in our specified for those tablets perfectly. So now we get to the Matrice 100 layout here and these, this will sink all the way down and so you have enough space according to what accessories you have. And like I said before, it's deep enough. So let's say you have guidance. Let's say you have dual battery compartments or any sort of computers or sensors on board. Um, this will allow you to have access to all of those accessories um, and without having to change the case or move anything around. What we decided to do with the center compartment here is we have up to three layers of pick and pluck foam. So it's different foam than this harder foam here. And just in this center part, you'll have layers of pick and pluck that you can customize for your specific setup. So again, if you have those additional accessories or if you have multiple cameras or sensors, you can actually just adjust and take out foam pieces to fit different boxes. So there's multiple layers of that and that will go all the way to the bottom. And so you have the full and complete customization that you need for the Matrice, which we found was really necessary because everybody's setup with the Matrice is going to be different. Um, we even left enough space up front here to, for any future sensors or bigger cameras. So they have the mount for the Zenmuse X5 as well. So you're gonna need more space in the front here. So we left a good amount just to compensate for any future cameras or sensors that they come out with. So now we'll move on to the motor compartments here. When the Matrice slides in, the legs will go down in these compartments. And you'll notice that there, it's about a centimeter from the bottom of the case. So they have full flexibility to put any accessories or uh, different sensors as you please. There's enough room here to really max out anything that you could put on the Matrice and it has enough room in this space here to, to make up for that. Now on the top lid of the case here, we actually have a cut out section in the shape of a circle and that's actually gonna go right over the GPS module. So you can actually still close the case with the lid on top because of that dedicated section there for the GPS. So with that, we'll go ahead and close the lid on the case here. So that pretty much sums it up for the Aerial Media Pro's custom Pelican case for the Matrice 100. The case is exclusively available through aerialmediapros.com. You're not gonna find it anywhere else, so go ahead and go over to our website where you can access more information on it, as well as save some money when you bundle it together with any of our current Matrice 100 packages. Until then, we'll see you on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Thanks so much for watching.